pretty soon I found that my language background and interests there were really coming together with the parent advocacy and so I moved into the world language advocacy world and just the work itself I became our state's first uh, world languages program supervisor in 2008 and then I came to Seattle School District as a, an employee there I'd previously worked as a consultant so what I've understood is that Doing the work depends on the advocacy, because if we're not getting support from our state agencies, from the federal government, from the people who fund and set the priorities for education, then it doesn't matter what we want to do in our classrooms, we won't have the opportunity to do it. So I, I see myself as a, as a person uh, to be out there to get the support that our teachers in the classrooms need, and also to really keep in focus that we're doing this for our students.